Let's take 3 eighths here and divide that by 2. So 3 eighths divided by 2. So first off, 3 eighths, that's less than 1. That's a smaller number than 1. And we're trying to see how many times 2 goes into this number less than 1. So we should get a pretty small number. Keep that in mind. Let's take the 2 here. Instead of 2, let's call this 2 over 1. 2 over 1 is still 2. We're just dividing by 1. But now things line up better. We take our 3 eighths here instead of division. We're going to multiply by the reciprocal of 2 over 1. So you take the 2, the numerator, move it down to the bottom. Denominator comes to the top. So 1 over 2. So 1 half. Now with fractions, it's a little bit easier to do because we take 3 times 1. We multiply the numerators, then multiply the denominators. 8 times 2 is 16. So in answer to our question, 3 eighths divided by 2, or you could say 3 eighths times 1 half, that gives you 3 sixteenths. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.